So are you getting frustrated with Final Cut Pro 10's connected clips feature? You know, it's that little feature where you add a title or you put one clip on top of another. And then when you go to move that bottom clip, everything moves around with it. It's quite handy in some situations, but in some situations, you don't want the top clip to move. You want it to stay put. Well, I'm gonna show you how you can turn the feature off in this video. Hey there, I'm Mark Brown from Editor's Keys and welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, we have a ton of videos all about Final Cut Pro 10, so consider subscribing. But anyway, let's jump into Final Cut Pro. Let's not waste any time and let's show you how this is done. Okay, so we're inside Final Cut Pro and what I've done is I've created a quick sequence here. I've connected a title to this first clip of the pub uh, and then as we get closer to this other pub here, you can see I've connected this shot of a red post box. Now, what usually happens, and this is the problem you'll be facing, is if you want to move this clip here of the pub out of the way, you can see that the red post box video clip above it stays connected to it. Same with this title uh, intro sequence here. If I move this out of the way, it stays with the clip below it because it's a connected clip. And sometimes this is what you want to do. But, you know, I'm sure you're watching this video because you've got your timeline exactly how you want it and you just want these clips unconnected. So it's really, really simple. All you need to do is simply hold down the tilde key on your keyboard and then you'll get this little orange icon appear. Then what you need to do is hold this down, keep this held down and then drag the bottom clip out of the way and you'll see that the red post box clip has stayed in its place and all the other clips have moved uh, back, uh, you know, back into its place, which is what you want to do if you don't want the clips to be connected. So let's just try that again here with the title. So I'm going to hold down the tilde key and then we're going to move this out of the way. I'm just going to put it on top of this for the second. And then you can see the title has stayed in its own timing, but now it's over these two shots here of the marketplace and the pub sign. So that's really, really good. Now, another thing you can do if you're struggling with the magnetic timeline. Now, this is a little bit different and we've talked about this in a different video, but let's just say you have this timing exactly right, but you want to move this clip out of the way and you don't want all of these uh, clips to the left to kind of magnetically connect to the clip to the left. All you have to do is press the P key, which is the position tool. It will change to the position tool and then you can drag this clip out of the way and you'll see you now have a gap clip and then you can drag another clip in its place or you can just move it around however you like. But essentially that is how you deal with connected clips and unconnect them in Final Cut Pro 10. So there we go. That's just a quick video today and I hope that's helped you with your problem. If it did, let me know in the comments section below. And as I say, we've got a ton of more videos about Final Cut Pro 10 that you can watch up here or checking out the link in the description below. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.